Guyana Sugar Corporation will be getting $3.6 billion as part of the $16.8 billion requested by the previous board of directors to bail the company out of its woes. Minister within the Ministry of the Presidency, Joseph Harmon, said that the Minister of Agriculture, Noel Holder, took the request to Cabinet on Tuesday. From the production returns of Gaisuko, that we expect at least 60% or thereabouts of that sum to be repaid to the government coffers. The Minister of Agriculture is to lead a drive for better markets for sugar. The government is contending that the reliance on the European market must be reviewed. A number of countries to which um, our sugar is sold, but that we needed to have a better and a deeper appreciation of those particular markets so that we can get a better price for our sugar. The European market absorbs 60% of Guyana's sugar, but the price isn't the most attractive. Mr. Harmon said that one shouldn't consider this as a case of pouring money down a hole. Instead, the cost of production is even higher than the price Guyana gets for its sugar. Harmon said that something is being done about this. We have asked for a full-fledged inquiry into sugar and into the future and the, the, the future course that we're going to take in relation to sugar. But the situation also has national implications given the thousands who earn a living from the industry. He said that sugar is like the mother of the labor movement in the country. We are trying to clean up that hole into which the money is poured. As a result of some changes that we have made, um, we've actually been able to save insofar as certain fees that are paid to people within Gaisuko are concerned at least 14,000 US dollars per month. Fees that were paid to certain persons who are working in the industry and in our view are basically not doing anything much. Mr. Harmon identified a number of people who have been sent off to effect the savings. Yes, there was um, a PR consultant that had to be um, laid off. There were some um, Indian nationals, um, I think there were some engineers at Skeldon who were, who were there and um, seemed to have been doing nothing much in relation to sugar. And so I think the combined effect of those two groups um, amounted to almost 14,000 United States dollars per month. The government is also looking at other measures to reduce the operational costs. Adam Harris, Prime News.